this year we're, we really want to be faster. Um, we have a, uh, you know, we lost obviously a big group of guys. Uh, we got a good core coming back. So, you know, within that, uh, the big thing that we needed to do was be a faster hockey team. I thought after finishing in the top four a year ago, uh, I thought our speed at, at that point in time wasn't quite up to where we needed it to be to, to win a Robertson Cup. Certainly have lots of other things to do, but that's certainly one area that we want to improve on. I think our division this year is going to be a lot better than, than a year ago. I thought it was good a year ago, but it certainly uh, will be better. Uh, Wilkesbury was a vastly improved team all year long. They got better and better as the year went on. Uh, they got a year under their belt, so I expect them to be really good. They had some coaching changes in uh, New Jersey and obviously with a new team in Boston. Um, so I, you know, I fully expect they're, they're capable guys. So I would expect them to be to be good. I know Jersey was was a team we battled with all year long, but uh, they have some thin guys returning and should be pretty good. Um, the uh, Johnstown, obviously one of the better places, uh, you know, to watch a hockey game with the old building there in Johnstown, and they seem to do a really nice job. Mike does a great job there. And they've been uh, good. they've been good every year. So I expect it to be uh, a very competitive division night in and night out. really have goals. Um, we, we have a process that, that we follow that, that we want to want to follow every day. Um, we want it to be the best. We want to be the best we can be every day. I know that's that's pretty uh, you know uh, pretty consistent with every coach. But uh, there's a culture in which we want to create. Uh, we try to create, and um, we're going to follow it. And our process is, is that we need to be good Monday through Thursday. Um, so the things that we do become repetitious that we're allowed to play at the highest level Friday and Saturday. Um, and that's really our goal uh, each and every day that we get to the rink. And, uh, you know, obviously the end goal would be to, uh, you know, win a Robertson Cup. But that's a long way away. But we'll take our day at a time uh, to create our culture and, and uh, follow our process. I think it has a lot to, to do with, with our league and the direction our league is going closing of the gap between our league and, and in fact growing uh, exponentially more so than, than some of the other leagues in North America. Um, the USHL obviously being you know, the, the number one provider of, of college hockey players, us being number two, I think it has a lot to say with our coaches, our players, the recruiting process, the scouts. I just think everything in general is, is, is growing in our league and getting better. From a player's perspective, I, I really believe it's the ability to make a first impression. Um, I think there's kids that come out of there with scholarships because their impression is so good. It, it, it's just it's great for our league. You know, they uh, they do a great job. It's you know it's the Super Bowl of our league. Uh, there's nobody that's not there, and it's certainly an opportunity for our players to put their best foot forward. Our organizations, uh, you know, to uh, you know to grow our league, to, to put our league on the map. Um, there's an awful lot of positives about it. I just think that there's an, a ton to do. I mean, there's, you know, everything's five minutes away. Um, and you literally, there's pro sports, there's music, there's arts, there's entertainment. We're two hours from the city, New York City, that it is. Uh, there's nothing that, uh, you know, 90 minutes from Washington, the, the history of the city. Um, there's a lot to do outside the rink here, and it's certainly uh, a place where you can have a lot of fun uh, learning, um, enjoying, uh, whether it be parks, um, you know, just the, the, the history of the city in itself is fantastic. I think the competitive nature of the league, the league every day, you need to be on your toes and, and, and play to the, the best of your ability, individually and as a team. The, uh, I know our league, our, I know how we run our program. Uh, I'm very interested in wanting to see kids grow and get better, as I think most coaches are. Uh, here in town, we have a lot of ice time. Uh, I think most buildings do, and teams do. I think we practice at non prime time. So the ability to grow as a person, the ability to grow as a player, um, as well as you know the number of commitments that we have from our league, I think speaks volumes. Our identity will take time. Uh, I certainly know what, I, what I'd like our identity to be. Uh, a 
that is a hard working, uh, hard team to play against uh, in your face kind of kind of hockey, uh, high tempo, push the pace. Um, what it will be um, is something that, that takes time to one, build and two, identify as to what we want to be, the players we have. And certainly, as I said previously, I, I think we've recruited the players to be those things, um, but it's something that will take time you know, to exactly put what our identity is. But it won't take long, but we're going to identify it early and, and uh, certainly uh, bring it to the, the players' attention that this is how we want to do things and, and this is how we have to play to be successful.